Okay, I am going to show you how I create word searches. Uh, this is a great idea for the first day of school. You can put all your student names into a word search so that they feel like part of the classroom community as soon as they arrive on the first day. So to do this, first of all, go into PowerPoint. Um, I should mention too, I know that there's some programs online that you can use to make word searches and there's probably other ways. I'm just going to show you how I personally do it. So if you go into PowerPoint, you're going to um, probably be given a slide something like this. First thing I do is get rid of that. And then if you go to design, slide size, page setup, just gonna do letter paper so that it fits. And we want there. So now we've got our letter uh, size of paper. Okay, I'm going to go to insert a table. I'm going to make the table about 12 times, or 12 by 12. And so we get something like this. To get rid of all the blue, we're just going to scroll through here and, oops, I missed it. Do this one. And then we'll stretch that table out. And now we've got our grid for our word search. So now what I would just do is start putting in your student names. So, um, okay, you just type your letters in the grid. Here's, okay, there we go. Uh, now, obviously the letters, we don't want them like that. So what I'm gonna do is highlight the entire table and we are going to make the let letters centered inside the box and um, a little bit bigger. So let's go about 20 for a font size. We could probably go a little bit bigger actually. Okay, that's 22. And now what we're going to do is center the letters using that one and um, align them to the middle of the box. So that'll just put them right in the center of the box. So now you just go ahead and um, add all your student names. So we're just going to go through and type them and uh, put them backwards and diagonal and however you want them. And then what you'll do after is just fill in all the other boxes <clears throat> with random letters. So yeah, obviously I'm not gonna do the, whoops, that's not what I wanna do. Mm, I was pressing the wrong button. So yeah, I'm not gonna do the entire thing obviously, but that is how you can do it. And then you will just um, add your words to find down at the bottom. The way that you do that is just add a text box. And so I can now just type the words that I want students to find. And what I can just do is add a few text boxes or I can copy and paste this one and then just put some other names in here. And that's how you can create a word search. I'm not going to go through the entire process because that would take a long time, <clears throat> but uh, but that's this is one way. Something else that you can do if you don't want the grid lines on this table, you can actually take them out. So if you go to table design and if you want no borders, just go like this and it'll take all those lines out for you um, at the very end. I would wait to do that though until you have all your letters in the word search. So I hope this helps. If you want to create your own word search uh, with student names or with any other words that are specific to your school or your classroom uh, for the first day of school or for any other, any other time during the year. All right. Thanks so much. Have a good day.